The Calgary Flames were in the spotlight, with multiple teams making offers for disgruntled defenseman Nikita Zadorov. However, only one of those proposals, coming from the Vancouver Canucks, managed to overcome financial obstacles to complete the deal. Surprisingly, the Toronto Maple Leafs were among the teams that made an offer to Flames GM Craig Conroy for Zadorov, according to Sportsnet sources. However, due to salary restrictions, Toronto requested that Calgary withhold part of the resilient defender's salary, valued at $3.75 million. The Vancouver Canucks, in turn, showed sagacity in negotiations. By trading Anthony Bovilla to Chicago, freeing up salary cap space after Corey Perry's contract expired, the Canucks were able to send a 2024 fifth-round pick from the Blackhawks and their own 2026 third-round pick to acquire Zadorov, fully assuming his salary for the last season of his contract. A strategic move that paid off for Vancouver. Meanwhile, the Toronto Maple Leafs face salary cap challenges due to John Klingberg's injury. The player is considering hip surgery that could end his season. Coach Sheldon Keefe and GM Brad Treliving are awaiting updates on Klingberg's status as Toronto, already without three of its top six defensemen, seeks outside reinforcements. The Flames, in turn, still have trade options for players like Noah Hannafin and Chris Tanev. The Flames, currently winners of five of their last eight games, are in a challenging position trying to secure a playoff spot. Stay tuned for more updates. And now, we want to hear your opinion. Comment below what you think of these movements in the hockey market. If you haven't registered yet, click the sign up button and don't miss any details. Until the next video.